plug in my heater and freeze them. It is 4.34. I just woke up. We're gonna do something with this. And we have lots of stuff to make. So we are going to the best for Target, Verizon, and then we're gonna pick up some food, get our hairs, and there's a need of a wash, but I'm trying to make a pot and this. It took me an hour to get ready because I'm ridiculous. So let's put in where we're going. So we're eventually going to go to Verizon. Dang, I should have gotten some water. My mouth is so dry. I kind of want to get a coffee though. So we're going to go to Verizon, Spy, Parjay. Then we're doing a mukbang later for Jollibee. I've never had Jollibee before, so I'm excited. And then we're gonna go home. And that's the plan for tonight, or right now. Wi-Fi is not working, my phone's messed up. Do you see how cracked it is? It's like going so slow now, so I think I'm gonna have to get a new phone. So let's go run the errands. I did a load of laundry before I left, so I'm feeling very productive. So when I get home, I will just do more laundry. <laughs> I really wanna clean, but Cleaning is like literally my least favorite thing to do in the whole world. So let me preface this by saying I got off work this morning and got home, showered, did all my normal stuff, and then um, I read my book, went to sleep, and then I woke up around 4.30. So I don't set an alarm on my off days because I just, I stay on night shift. Um, because I work four days a week and for me I only have like two days off or one day off so for me it's not worth flopping back to days then flopping back to nights if that makes sense if I only worked three days a week I would 100% flop back but for me it's just not worth it to be honest but okay I've been sleeping kind of bad here recently um, but I think it's just because I'm just stressed about a lot of things. I just overthink everything. And also, I got a ticket the other day. Although, it's not really a ticket. It's like a fix-it ticket. Which I'm just pissed because he didn't really explain to me like what to do with it. And I've never even heard of a fix-it ticket. So, I'm just so irritated. Like, I've just been in such a bad mood because I've been so upset and stressed about this fix it ticket so i got the ticket because i don't have like a front license plate in california but i'm from alabama and so he was like you need to call your dmv and like figure out how they can get it here um 
he was like, I don't really know because I'm not from Alabama. So I called Alabama DMV and she was basically like, all, she was like, Alabama only requires one plate, which is in your rear. Anyways, I've just been in a funk these past few days, so I'm just trying to get out of it. Okay, I just got back and I cannot believe I paid $15 for like a little bitty little pack of toilet paper. And literally, every time I get my toilet paper from Sam's Club, it's like 20 or $25, but like I get triple times the amount of toilet paper. I only got a small one because I'm only gonna be here for like eight, eight more weeks. And so I didn't wanna like have a whole bunch of toilet paper to bring home because my car is already packed whenever I'm driving. So now we're going to Best Buy. But yeah, I can't believe it was just like this little bitty teeny tiny thing. And then I got my Akatar series and I could not be more excited. It's five books in the Akatar series, so that means I have six books. And like normally I feel like, okay, if I read one book a week, but I can literally read a book in like one or two days. Because I'm just a fast reader. I consume it like that, especially if I'm really interested. But yeah, so from Best Buy, I have to get this SD card um adapter for my laptop because i clearly didn't bring mine from home which i know i did so i know when i get home and i clean tonight i'm gonna find it but i really needed it so i can edit my youtube videos i got this headset for streaming hi um i have kind of a big order um can i get the bacon and cheese chicken sandwich the two-piece chicken joy meal deal here you go hi thank you Thank you guys, have a good day. You too. This raspberry tea is so freaking good. Ah, oh, no, something fell. Please, I literally spilled my biscuits and gravy the last time I came out here. I'm so hungry. All I can think about is this food that I'm about to eat, hopefully soon. Where are the fries at, at least? They're not salted at all. the fry itself is actually really good. Dang, man. I dropped a freaking fry down there. is over so now I have to clean I'm so excited let me give you a little pan of the room yes I'm not excited but I do I'm excited because my room has been needing cleaning for the past like four weeks and I haven't done it because I've been streaming and working and all the things so I'm glad I'm taking this night to clean because I really need to For a little bit so this is the third book that i'm reading twisted hate by anna huang i'm on chapter 44 I'm almost done with the book so i'm probably just gonna read till my bed sheets come out and then i'll make my bed and just read for the rest of the night it is 8 20 so i won't be reading for a really long time i'll probably start the fourth book hopefully i finish it and then i can start the akatar series i'm glad that i'm back in my book reading era um yeah, I wish I could have cleaned more. Maybe I'll feel like cleaning more later, but I'm just so tired right now. So, good night. Thanks for spending the off day with me. <laughs> Bye.